The X-47 Bravo is a strike fighter sized unmanned aircraft and was designed to help the Navy explore the future of unmanned aircraft aviation through various carrier based test flight operations. Successful testing of the aircraft will help set the stage for the development of a more permanent carrier based fleet of unmanned aircraft. The X-47 Bravo can fly farther and stay in the air longer than existing aircraft because it doesn't depend on the endurance of Navy fighter pilots. USS Harry S. Truman recently made history by hosting the first taxi of the unmanned aircraft. Petty Officer MJ Gonzalvo has the full story. USS Harry S. Truman sailors and members of the Navy Unmanned Combat Air System Program Office Integrated Testing taxied an X-47B Unmanned Combat Air System Demonstrator on the ship's flight deck December 9th. The test marks the first time the aircraft has ever taxied aboard a carrier. It takes an awful lot to, to have an unmanned aircraft taxi on a moving ship. It's a very, very complex evolution. Uh, very, very important for us to demonstrate that, and I think we did it today quite well. North of Grumman deck operators used an arm-mounted control display unit to maneuver the aircraft under directions from Truman's aircraft directors. To be out here, to see the support the crew is giving, uh, to be working with the Navy, NAVAIR, and North of Grumman engineers, it's just a whole team effort, and uh, it's just been a really good experience. Truman is the first aircraft carrier to host test operations for an unmanned aircraft. Aboard USS Harry S. Truman, I'm Petty Officer MJ Gonzalvo. This is a major milestone for the X-47 Bravo, which is scheduled to complete taxi testing before Truman returns to its home port in Naval Station, Norfolk. From Defense Media Activity, I'm Petty Officer Amara Timberlake.